Now moving on, the Alcohol Beverages Association of Kenya has strongly disagreed with the International Institute for Legislation and Students' Campaign against drugs' proposal to increase taxes on alcohol. The Alcohol Association told the Finance and Planning Committee of the National Assembly that the move would encourage cross-border illicit trade and also cause the collapse of local manufacturing. To increase or not to increase taxes on alcohol and tobacco products dominated Friday's public participation being conducted by the Finance and Planning Committee of the National Assembly. Alcohol Beverages Association of Kenya warned that drastic tax increment on alcohol will push consumers to use illicit brews, saying currently 59% consume illicit liquor. 59% of this market is illicit. We actually need as a country to invest resources in recruiting from illicit, uh, while we acknowledge that the government has given enforcement support towards it. But the principle underlining why illicit is growing in alcohol space is the reality that legitimate alcohol is not affordable. They have proposed the taxes to be proportionate to the alcohol percentage. If there is really need to increase excise rates, let's consider staggering it, and at the highest rate, if there is really need to increase, we propose a 10.68 percentiliter. However, university and college students, under the umbrella of students' campaign against alcohol and the International Institute for Legislation Affairs, propose stiffer taxes on alcohol and tobacco products with the intent to reduce their consumption in a bid to promote healthy living. Level of alcohol use on any month is 11.8 percent. And that is very, very critical. And that is trajectory that is likely to go, up, to go higher if the prices are reduced. The only measure for, uh, in tobacco control, there are other measures like a ban in public smoking and all the others. But tax is the most effective because then um, we know that especially young people and poor uh, households are responsive to price increases. The chair of the committee said the parliament will consider the input of stakeholders before tabling the report to parliament. Like for example, the reasoning by National Treasury and the Ministry of Industrialization on taxing uh, uh, alcoholic beverages by centiliter of alcohol uh, is so that to discourage consumption of the of of, of alcoholic drinks that are of high alcohol content. Members of the public have ten days to submit their views.